People keep asking if I'm back, and I haven't really had an answer. But now, yeah, I'm thinking I'm back. Good, I, don't, I don't eat food like I used to. No? No. No how chickens before. Slow down. Okay. A little bit. <laughs> David Vasquez, nickname Queasy, play for Sacramento DMG, number 14. This would be my eighth year with the camp. Kind of bounced back and forth between D3, D2. Had the stint in semi-pro actually in 2019 where we ended up getting second place overall in the series. I guess. You know you did. I mean, who misses a camera in their face? <laughs> My name is George McLean. I play front Dorito for Sacramento DMG. I've been in the camp since 2013 and currently entering into my third year pro and my number is 25. I feel like I used to be a really aggressive player and I would uh, almost try and, you know, try to push too hard sometimes. And honestly, that's the only way that you learn. You gotta see if you can make those moves or not. I feel like I still have that game. Um, it's just mostly switching up the style to, you know, the field layout, the game plan, maybe even the team that we're playing. Good to go. Basic as fuck. My name is Dylan Boyum. I'm number 21. I play for Sacramento DMG. Um, last time we were doing this, I was uh, in the divisional ranks. I was on the semi-pro team. Um, Worked my way up to the pro squad, and, and now I'm here. Honestly, this year, you know, a lot of people were online saying, you know, we lost Joe, we lost Josh. Those are two very, very good paintball players, man. They got great minds for the game. They're very good. I mean, if I'm being completely honest, I think that's the best thing to happen to our squad at this point in time. The reason I say that, man, is because we understand, you know, Joe and, and Josh were someone that we relied on a lot, especially Joe. He played every point for us. With losing a player like that, it, it forces everybody that's here to step their game up and start playing at a higher level. Um, I think that's something that we're going to have to do this year to compete. What up? I'm Marvin Gerber, pro player with Sacramento DMG. I uh, was on the team that brought the team to pro. Playing a ton of paintball with uh, the new formulation of the squad. And it's, it's actually been sweet. I think it's going to be the strongest version of DMG we ever had. Uh, everyone has very like-minded personalities, play styles and just thought processes. Our entire get down is the same. I'm just uh, being honest with you, I literally got bored. That sounds stupid as fuck. I know, fuck. My name is Jordan Boyum, uh, brother to Dylan on the pro Sacramento DMG team, number 75. I joined the team last year during COVID. Uh, originally we came from the semi-pro team though, spent a couple years down there. My brother and I were only about a year and a half apart. We pretty much had the same hobbies and interests our whole lives. Um, I think I was actually the first one to get a gun and then he saw how cool it was and we were shooting in the backyard. He's like, oh, I gotta get a gun too. And then we started playing one-on-ones uh, -on -one against each other and I'll never forget. I was like, okay, well, let's, let's actually go to an actual field and go shoot at other people instead of ourselves. That was history, but now being on the pro team, um, I mean, it's one of the coolest experiences, right? Like a lot of guys are playing pro or playing competitive paintball, but to play with your brother, someone that, uh, you trust more than anyone is it's like a bonus um, definitely working out here at practice though you know off the field uh, or in between points you know he's gonna be the hardest right hardest critic for me he wants me to be the best possible player I can be 
and uh, and I'm gonna hold them on the other end, right? Or it's pretty equal. Um, so yeah, it can get a little a little hot sometimes when we're trying to discuss our differences on our opinions. But at the end, I mean, we're a team, regardless who's on my team and, and whether it's my brother or someone else. Uh, we're going to disagree, and then we're going to come to a conclusion and agree and move forward. He's probably going to go into Marvin's gun, so I just look right and try to help Luigi get out. But, yeah, we're all, we're on the same page. We just kind of fucked up the kill count. I don't it, know. It, it just took me a while to figure out who the white guy went. Okay. Like, Canada's nice, but if I hear Dragon Canada, then I'm like, oh, I'm not just hearing Canada, like, as a random bunker. And, like, yeah. Yeah, I, I, yeah, that's on me. I got that. I got that. Dragon nice. Just learn from it. ones that hate me the most look just like me you tell me what that means make a slick comment and see what that brings i've seen it go down we can reenact things extreme like bmxing these boys pussy and they pmsing people in the city see the movement occurring and say my god i want to be in that scene damn right you want to be in this scene she had the video trying to be in this scene used to fantasize about being this scene bluegrass girl but she got big dreams can't touch me, I got instincts. Locked in the house, but I'm plotting things. I brought a gang to the party with me. Five white boys, but they not in sync. <gasps> Fuck what y'all think. Fuck everything that you say about me. My dogs like to play mad in the 2K. But one thing they don't do is play about me. My homeboy Tyler, he playing South Beach. He told me this summer he gon' fix my jumper. I told Boy Wonder that we might got a thumper. I've been trying to pop, now I'm on like Shumper. <laughs> Now they on my bumper, green room chock full of all my comforts Hotel room like heaven on earth, got angels in my bed with some all white covers Ace Pro Nemo, Lucy and Kiso, Sloop Clay Tufo And I got a few more, I call my brothers I got a lot of flows and they all like butter Ooh, You know what that means, I came home nice but I'm going back mean I'm about to globe trot when they know a vaccine Motherfuckers act lost but they know exactly what's going on Made a mill and I don't know what to blow it on I tell a critic shut up like my show is on Gave a t-shirt to a set, throw it on She want a mini high school classmates, I'm growing on My peers ain't popping, they don't know what's going wrong Y'all well dressed, but you ain't got soul and you just can't sew it on. I'm trying to tell y'all boys, I gotta be. Everyone's good, right? But you're starting to learn like where other guys' skills are at. You shot me once, but you want one You shot me once, I shot you once for one on one. Technically, you got shot once on a three on one. Y'all bitches are not first shot, too. I was ripping one little quick. Yeah, I saw my friend coming on the field. I figured I wasn't going to shoot you. I just like Marvin's buzzer, so I didn't have to inflict any pain. I think uh, this may be the best version DMG's ever had. This year, we're all in the same mindset. We had a, we had a couple good talks to where uh, we're ready to put that work in, and we're ready to get back to that Sunday paintball. I think that's the main goal with us. I think last year, we kind of took our foot off the, the gas a little bit, and we you saw the results, you know? We did great in the Invitationals. We went out the first one and whooped everyone's ass and got first place. Second one, you know, we lost the Golden State Knights, but that, that's a team that's full of a lot of very, very good paintball players that have been in the pro ranks for a long time. Um, so that was our real test. And then as far as the NXL events, man, we had some hiccups. I think our records didn't show, you know, how good we played. If you go back and watch our games, like we, we were in each game. Um, but, you know, sometimes those long points would get away from us and, you know, the score would rack up. And, Kind of is what it is, but we keep fighting. Uh, we're going to be a team out there, ready to compete. We've all been training this off season, getting as many reps in together as we can, drilling, playing the fundamental things that we need to do on the field, playing our three on three, situational. We're just growing our game, and our goals for the year are just to whoop some ass out there and show everybody that we're still in this shit. Hey, they just try, they trap me in the beast. Like, I already know. That's fine, right? Fine. We were going to play short on the beast. I went on like, snake side. I made happened. snake kill one, but it ended up working out because George straight. came over yeah, and, and we ended up fucking with his kill and shot him. Yeah. And then uh, because the but whole was shooting high at straight me, straight George took the under to go across. That's fine. As long as they know, like when George dies, as long as Jordan and them know that's that's going on, that's fine. Everyone on that squad is working out a ton. You know, we're all eating good. We're all constantly watching paintball, studying the game and drilling. So I'm very excited about this team. I want to win a championship, I want to win a paintball championship, and uh, I'm on that ass, you know, fucking, fucking on that ass. <laughs> Alright, perfect, George.